all-round responsive. Last year, we saw a rapid increase in the amount of sites going responsive and it would appear that the demand for responsive sites will only increase in 2014. The statistics are shocking and they're rising as more and more people are accessing sites via their tablet or mobile. Phones and tablets are so advanced nowadays, there's absolutely no need for us to be sitting uncomfortably at a desktop or with the laptop on our knee, no, gone are those days, no we can sit on the sofa by the fire, snuggle into our blankets and search and shop until we drop apparently, over 62% of websites that turned their design into a responsive one saw a considerable improvement in sales over this year. How about this, over 55% of mobile users access the internet via their mobile and an astounding 45% of those actually prefer using their mobile over their desktop. So, the time has come for us to get responsive, but what about email? If our clients love using their mobile devices for accessing the net, that means they're just as keen on accessing their emails via phone. Let's face it, life's getting more and more hectic and the actual free time we have left at the end of the day is not going to be spent sitting at our desktop checking emails. So what do we do, we check our mail on the go. 50% of us. 50% of email users check their email on their mobile, hence the reason why we have to get email responsive and quick, get ahead of the game, get responsive, now this might seem like the easy part. But as with traditional email marketing methods, responsive email has different criteria and a few steps that you must take into consideration. Cut the fluff, it might sound stupid, but mobiles have smaller screens. Not, I'm not being patronizing, I know you all know that, but you must consider that when sending out responsive emails. Cut out the unimportant, fluffed up bits. In order for the email to be responsive, it must be readable on a mobile device. Some parts of the email will have to be adapted to fit the screen and ability of the reader to read slash view the content. Bigger buttons, most people don't carry a magnifying glass around with them, so make sure your call to action is clear. Adapt the layout to make sure all the important bits are where they should be, mobile users will find it frustrating trying to expand and press smaller buttons. Ensure that you can encourage engagement by choosing the right images that suit to a mobile device and will get your message across quickly. Don't forget, these readers are most likely on the go, they haven't go time to sift through the email. Use correct fonts, colors, designs, and pictures to call to action immediately. All-round responsive, this is quite basic, yet sometimes we forget to look at our marketing and business efforts as a whole, tending to each department separately. If you're sending a responsive email, you have reason to believe that the user is using a mobile device, thus making it imperative your site is also responsive. There's no point calling your customer to action, them clicking through and your site doesn't respond. That will just be embarrassing. The dreaded code, coding a responsive email, requires a lot of skill, technique and testing. As this type of email is still in its early days, there has to be a little more testing on numerous devices done before your email will go out. This isn't your standard email going out to a standard email inbox. There are a few different types of devices you are trying to respond to here and it's not going to be plain sailing. When trying to cut out images that can't be shown on a mobile device using CSS coding, if it isn't done correctly, the images could end up downloading anyway. The worst part of that outcome is that it will result in your email taking way too long to be opened and slow down the user, which will only end in your mail being deleted. We have advanced so much that we no longer accept delay. We are all guilty of it, when we want something we want it now, and this applies even more so to the world of technology. Consumers nowadays are even more difficult to please as there is always someone who is one step ahead and can beat us at our own game. They haven't got time, so if they can get what they want and need somewhere else, they're gone. In order for us to stay ahead of our game, we have to get moving and fast and listen to the wants and needs of our customers. Did you know that over 70% of mobile users who open their mail on their mobile devices have stated that when an email doesn't open, they delete it? With shocking statistics like that, I think it's time we all started working towards one common goal. Getting all-round responsive.